you the two, the two guys that are out this week for sure. Uh, Jamal Adams didn't practice today. He's out. And then uh, Otis is also out and did not practice. So those two guys will be out. The rest of it uh, is as the report will read, and we'll go re ready for Sunday. Hop going to be questionable? He'll be listed as uh, questionable, but we'll see where we're at Sunday. Kelly, he, he kind of credited the Titans with trusting him and going to California to do mm -hmm. some of that rehab on the knee. Uh, what was that whole conversation process like? I'm presuming there's lots of communication yeah. throughout. Now, he came and saw me and, and said he had a handful of things he would like to go do, and he had plenty of conversations with uh, Todd Torcelli, and, and we decided that he's, you know, if God's played the, as long as he's played, knows what he needs, and so we allowed him to – uh, go get the treatment that he felt like he needed to be ready to play for uh, week one. So uh, it was pretty straightforward, and he was great. Just communicated what he needed and what he wanted, and we worked with him on that. Is his thing a thing players? that could hang over his head and the team's head in terms of potential to to bust at any to, to no. get worse at any time? Not to my not. I'm, I'm not a doctor, but not to my knowledge. I think everything is um, you know healed though so far the way it's supposed to, and I don't think there's any fear of any more injury than, than it was initially. Who are some receivers that, that could maybe step into that role if Hopkins can't be a full go on Sunday? Yeah, well, we got two that, I, that have had a really good preseason in, in Trey Burks and Nick Westbrook. Those guys have both done a really nice job. Um, so we got we got plenty of guys to come play receiver for us. And, um, you know, they've gotten a lot of reps because of Hop's absence, so they've practiced a lot too. So that part's also good. Uh, so I feel good, really good about those guys. No, you're saying there's fair expectations for Hop, even if he comes back and plays, given the absence and, and the yeah. injury and, and learning the new offense. Yeah, any any player that's coming off, you know, an injury or extended time, missed period of time, you're smart um, to ask a guy to go in there and play an entire game every snap is is a, is a tough ask, but. Um, it's funny what happens on game day sometimes, and the adrenaline gets flowing, and all of a sudden they say, "I'm good, man. Let me play." And so, so you do. But yeah, we're we're mindful of, of that, and any any guy returning from injury, not just a hop, um, about what the load is during during a game, and you try to be at least have some sort of plan in place to uh, rotate him enough. Knowing how that goes with the adrenaline flowing and everything, like how much goes into being able to make sure that you still protect the guy from himself, you know, yeah. that, that thirst to get back. That's our, that's that's the job of our training staff and myself. If we feel like, you know, whatever plan we enter the game with, we'll stick to. Uh, even though I, I know, I usually know what's coming when when a guy starts playing and starts feeling it, they want to keep playing. So uh, we'll be smart. You know, the, the plans and any any plan that we have is always going to be in place, and we do our best to, to stick to that um, because in the moment, guys want to keep going and keep playing, but it's a long-range view. We're trying to keep a guy healthy for an entire season. How has that been this week as far as, like, we see Hop out here you know, mm -hmm. going indie and everything, but during practice itself, how has that been making sure that he's getting to work, but also... Uh, it's been great. It's been smooth. He's gotten plenty of work. Um, as you guys have seen him out there, he works an individual. He gets his team reps. Um, you know, you're just making sure it's more about the conditioning, making sure he's ready to go play. Um, and so far, everything in that process has been really smooth. How did you feel like the week went as a whole, and how amped are, are guys ready to... Uh, I felt the week was great. Um, really thought our guys prepared well. I thought they practiced hard. Um, we had good energy all week. We had good enthusiasm. I mean, guys are fired up. It's, it's time to go play football, and uh, I'm really excited, and um, I think they are too. I think they're, they're excited to go show, show everybody what uh, the work we put in and, and what kind of team we have a chance to be.